everyone and welcome back to Star Stable. Today I'm going to be letting you guys choose the discounted horse that I buy. For horses of your vigor this month, the Mawari, Arabian and Aquatech have all been discounted. Why am I liking? Okay, thank you. Now, unfortunately, these horses go off of discount back to normal prices this Wednesday, the 12th of April. I went to film this video earlier, but I couldn't decide which horse I wanted to buy. So that's why I waited a little while and I asked you guys over my community tab what discounted horse I should buy and I have not looked at the results but I have kind of peaked a little bit throughout the week so I kind of want to like discuss the horses that I chose so let me do that really quickly so let's go to the Arabians first all right so here we are at Goldspur Farm and the Arabians are currently 570 star coin. The choices that I have of Arabians that I don't own are this white, sorry, gray one. Or this Palomino here. Technically on this account, I don't own the Bay Arabian, but I bought this horse on my alt account. So I didn't really feel like buying a double up of this one. So I ended up actually putting both of these Arabians onto the YouTube poll. Unfortunately, I can only do four options on the poll and i've got a lot more than four options that i don't own of these horses so i actually wasn't going to put this horse on the poll because i already own the flea bitten one and also the gray one and i was like do i really want this this one as well but i ended up preferring this one over some of the like the aquatech ones so um yeah speaking of aquatech so let's go check them out here are the Aquatex. The Aquatex are currently 510 star coins in discount. Now, one thing that I'm definitely going to do is change the mane to be like a longer one, just because I'm not a massive fan of the roached mane. Anyways, we actually have a lot of options here. We've got this one here. I always want to call this one a Cromello, but I believe it's actually a Polino. I talked with Georgia about this and she agrees with me that this one is actually a Cromello. So maybe you guys are just like tripping me out in the comments. Like, I don't know, I've got so many people telling me so many different things sometimes that like I try to do my own research, but then you guys still trip me up when I'm like, I looked on Google and you guys are like, Google is wrong. I don't know anymore. So honestly, I don't even know if this one's a Cromello or a Polino because it's like too dark according to some of the people pictures that I've seen on the internet. So at this point, it's a coat color and it's pretty and yeah. There's also this one here. Oh wow, it's shiny, that's so cute. And we also have the other one here. So we had like this one or this one. And then we also have the Dapple as well. So lots of Aquatex. I did end up only putting one on though because all of these ones are kind of similar. Like they're all that gray color. I think I ended up putting this one on the pole because the Mawari I ended up putting on the pole, the only Mawari that I don't own is like this color. And I was like, I don't know if I want to put two of the same color onto the pole. So yeah, I ended up only putting this one on because these ones were just too similar. I didn't know what to say. I kind of want to get all of the Aquatex in the future though, but it's also kind of nice to still have horses on my wish list. All right, and down here we have the Mawaris and the Mawari that I don't own is not here. Let me just... Uh... This one right here, I don't own this one. Honestly, I do really like this one. I really like the details of this horse and stuff. I definitely do not ride the Mawaris as much as I should. I think it's just because, like, there's not really one that I, like, love every single aspect of the coat. Actually, I do really like this one. I don't know, anyways. But, um, yeah, I definitely want to finish my, my Mawari collection soon because i feel like they've been out for ages and i still don't have my complete mawari collection but that's okay because once again i still like having generation 3 horses on my wish list because sometimes it feels like i own them all but now that i've kind of slowed down spending all of my star coins on the new horses like it's kind of fun to actually have horses that i still look forward to buying you know but let's go ahead over to the youtube poll and see what the results are if you don't know how to find the youtube poll or the community page you just have to go to my youtube and then you click community and here we go here is the poll there's actually 5,000 votes so thank you guys so much i did also promote this on my uh instagram but it looks like the arabian kind of won by a landslide that is the gray arabian i really like this new feature which is the picture polls it's not a new new feature but I really like it because I can actually have pictures of the horses instead of struggling for names. But yeah, I try to do like a few polls here and then. I kind of update you guys and things. YouTube did just bring out the feature to do 
a quiz with it so that could be kind of fun to explore so i feel like i really like community posts because i might be able to like connect with you guys a bit more but it looks like we are buying the gray arabian with 42 percent the aquatech the lowest at nine percent and then the palomino arabian and the mawari are super close with 22 percent on the mawari and 27 percent on the palomino arabian if i'm being honest the one that i think i wanted to buy was probably an arabian i'm sorry uh, so i'm pretty happy with that but honestly i kind of wanted the palomino arabian um the pentabians are coming out soon though star stable um put those ones on their official instagram spoiler things that they do with the ambassadors but the palomino arabian has been like it just reminds me of abigail pinehaven because she rides it in her star staple streams now um <laughs> probably until the new pentabians come out which is really exciting but yeah if i'm gonna be honest i was kind of rooting for the palomino uh but that's okay probably after that the mawari because then i could complete my collection just because i do already have the flea bitten arabian and i really love the flea bitten arabian you guys this one's really pretty to me love myself a flea bitten horse but that's okay Ooh, let's look at the different main styles arabians look so like every horse which has a special main style looks so different without its special main style and you can actually see that the coloring of it is slightly different i think this one's more like shaded or something that's so odd um yeah i feel like you know, I always talk about how I don't like the yellowish mane. So this is definitely a white mane. As you guys can see, it kind of stands out too much of this horse coat. What the heck? Oh my goodness. I totally see what you guys mean by like manes not being completely white. I think it just depends because this, this coat does have that darker gray kind of darker white color <laughs> it's like the actual white mane stands out a lot so i think i am just gonna keep the normal mane actually now unfortunately i didn't ask you guys the names um so i could actually take a name from one of my rival stars horse racing videos i've been trying to do some more rival stars videos lately because i really like breedy in them and i've asked you guys to put full suggestions in the comments below but i could just yoink one for this as well i think i do want this horse to be a mare that's just like the vibe that i'm getting okay this wasn't a suggestion but i just randomized the name and ghost came up and i feel like ghosty could be a fun name what about ghosty with an ie is that an option it is you know kind of quirky <laughs> i don't know if i really like ghosty but I kind of do. Now I'm not sure if I should, it should be like a gelding. Hmm, ghosty. Maybe he'll be a gelding. We're making like an adult. Sure. Why not? We'll do that. 570 star coins. <gasps> Before I do this. Oh my gosh, I have to X out of it. But you guys, I just wanted to say how I've got 64, 64 star coins. Like what a satisfying number. Anyways, let's go back to buying this horse. Adult, gelding, ghosty. Okay, that should be all correct. Okay, let's go ahead and buy. Yes, please. Thank you so much. Oh, uh, okay. I really do love the Arabians. Oh my gosh, they're so pretty. Okay, let's go ahead and send to stable. What level is Olive on? Olive is level 9. Olive is so close to leveling up. That's so annoying. <laughs> I gotta finish training Olive. <laughs> Moira has come to join us. Very cute, very cute. All right, is uh, Ghosty in the stables? Yes, here he is. Oh my gosh, so cute. Wait, I want to see. Oh, I, I always do that. The new state machine means that it's really, like, I struggle to hold. I click my buttons too quickly. There we go. I also can't see my screen. Okay, Moira, can you, like, turn to the side maybe? Okay, that's better. Hi, Ghosty. Look at you. See, look how cute that name is. I don't think I have a horse named Ghost. I'm not entirely sure I'm going to be honest. I'm stuck. Okay, there we go. Look how pretty. Okay, gray horses as well are just... Okay, Moira, no, please sit down. They're like so fun to make outfits for. Like pink looks good. Just all like the pastel colors look really good. Or you can make them look really sophisticated with like a navy color, you know? Like sophisticated. So cute. I don't... There's so many choices though. This one's so pretty. I believe that this saddle blanket is from... Um midsummer or something i'm gonna do a potentially silly thing and spend 110 star queens in this i say it's silly because the equestrian festival is currently here and i have to go ahead and buy some horses that are leaving they're being retired this week i have to go buy them as well like all of the money is being spent today oh let's look at bridles what if i used an arabian bridle i feel like i haven't used one of those in a while here's some of the arabian bridles we could use this one here what about 
Is there a, isn't there a light blue version of this, or like a pink version? There is a pink version and I don't own it. Spending more star coins, let's go. I feel like people are gonna have mixed opinions about my outfit because I'm wearing a dressage saddle, but I'm wearing Western clothing. I wanted to use the dressage saddle because then it doesn't cover all of like the pattern of the saddle blanket. I kind of like this outfit, okay? <laughs> but here is Ghosty. Thank you guys so much for helping me choose this horse. They also have a special move, which I always forget about. It's like so similar to their rear though. They just walk forward. Let me know in the comments below. Maybe I should actually go do the horses of your grace. <laughs> this is the whole reason that these horses are discounted. So let's go ahead and level up Ghosty to level two. By the way, horses on the Star Stable Horses app are not discounted, unfortunately. Let me know in the comments below if you guys bought any of the discounted horses. I just, I really, really love how Star Stable started doing these discounted horses. I think it's like super helpful. It's like unfortunate in the means that like you might want to buy a horse, but they're not going to be discounted for like five months or something. That might be a little bit dramatic, I don't know. Let me know what horses you're saving up for and whether, you know, what horse you want to be discounted next. I believe the Horses of Jorvik is on the same cycle as last year. So you could go back and look through the updates of last year and see what horse was discounted next. Yes, there we go. We're actually level three, which is really cool. Already getting up there in the world, ghosty. Well, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. On the screen right now is going to be a Rival Stars horse racing video. I spoke about it, you know, just before we were buying Ghosty. But yeah, I'm trying to kind of like make more videos than just Star Stable videos all about horses, you know. So Rival Stars horse racing is a really cool game. And basically, I'm just doing a bunch of breeding in the video on the screen right now. So if that sounds interesting to you guys, Rival Stars has a bunch of genetics and things like that. So it's really fascinating breeding and I really enjoyed it. All right, I love you guys so much and I will see you all very, very soon. Bye!